Darren, we're here at Celtic Park. It's a winter break for the first team. Of course, there are some what's going on. You might hear some the grass being cut in the background. No break for you. 5-0 win at the weekend. You must be really pleased. How's the recovery going on as well for the, the game tomorrow night? Yeah, it's going really well. The players have experienced that a lot this year with the volume of games we've got. Lowland League, Youth Champions League, um, the Premier League competition we're playing down south. Uh, the SPFL Trust Trophy, um, so all these different competitions has meant nearly playing every three days. I think Saturday was their 28th game of the season, that's a lot for these young players that have never experienced that, so part of the experience is how they recover um, while reflecting on the previous game and then uh, preparing for the next one. So they've, they've gained that experience this year and they're, they're going through it currently right now. Let's reflect on that one at the weekend. It was a 5-0 victory. Really good performance and some really good individual performances as well to get in with all the goals. Yeah, listen, what we've we've tried to do, and uh, we've spoke about it a bit, myself and Mick, is aligning with the first team in terms of style of play, and um, the speed of play and, and how they do things. But it's all with the, the overriding uh, view of trying to get players that when they step, hopefully step in with the manager's team, that they understand exactly what he wants. That's the whole purpose of it. But in order to do that, you need to be extraordinarily fit. I think anyone that comes and watches our first team realise how fast they play it and how how taxing that must be on your body. So to do that every three days, it's been um, exceptional. The players have managed to maintain the levels they had have, and that comes down to a lot of the preparation they do in between games. And it's Berwick Rangers up next. It was a defeat in July. It seems so long ago with all the games, of course. What can you expect from them? I'm sure it will be another tough encounter for the boys. Yeah, it will. Um, I know their manager really well. Um, I signed for East Kilbride for about 12 minutes, killed him. So, um, no, I have good experience with him. He's a really good guy, organises the team really well. And um, listen, as much as we'll know about them, they'll see a different animal than us. I think it was the second league game maybe of the season. Um, we've come on leaps and bounds in that time. Um, ultimately, where we want to go, we've still a long way to go. But the strides we've made this season, we've been very happy with. Um, so as much as we'll know what Berger about, um, it's more about what we do on the day. And good luck tomorrow, Darren. Thanks very much.